Yo, 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 we back once again with the True Hip Hop Podcast. It's your boy, DJ Blaze. And that guy again. Wolverine, and we back for episode 7-1-7. Seven, 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 seven. You ah. know what I mean? We looking oh so clean. Oh, but before no. we get started, make sure y'all subscribe to the channel. Right now. Like, comment, and share. Give us to your friend. It helps us out tremendously on the algorithm. Me and Wolf appreciate all the love y'all all been giving us. There. But y'all cats ain't been subscribing, so hit that bell. It's us. And make sure it's all notifications, you heard me. All right, man, we just want to just dive into these YouTube streets, man. Yesterday, Diddy's son, Christian King Combs, stepped in to defend his family name with a bristling track called Pick a Side, in which he threatens anyone coming at his father including the in the club rapper 50 cent he raps who put the city on the map stop lying pops been hated on by many men and niggas that's fine they gonna try to stop these m ms and they gonna die trying he raps while calling out 50 cent king kicks the diss off with the lubricant before telling the ops that um to kiss his dick and dares the public to keep chanting no diddy which in a catchphrase 50 cent had played a major role in popularizing during diddy's sexual abuse case 50 cent quickly got wind of the king's threats but essentially laughed it off with a response on social media the same night i feel so threatened by the things christian is saying on on social media i am afraid for my life Please don't hurt me, guys, he tweeted. I never posted anything about Puffy's kids because Keefy D said he killed Tupac. LOL. <laughs> you know what, man? I'm just kind of I'm I'm kind of tired of 50 in this troll. <laughs> he didn't say nothing. No, but he, King he Combs say, made the well, song. Well, because I mean, dude, <laughs> 50 been coming with this for months now, so don't say he didn't say nothing. He been saying something. So he just probably ain't said nothing within the last five days. No, but, he definitely has said something in the last five days. But lot. I'm saying but before about uh, about uh, his son. So you said Ken Combs should have made that song? No, the song was weak as hell. But yet and still, <laughs> I, I the song, that's not a diss. That's just, I don't know what the heck that is. Because he, he's not that type of rapper. Yeah, bro. but my thing is, back on 50 and his trolling, like, bro, you kind of hey, like. Hey, man, because he started No Diddy, man. He's That's not. what I'm saying though. Fifty, grow up, bro. You got all. You so successful, bro. You need to put more of your time. I think he in. do this here for fun, though. He get a I kick mean, out for of this shit. A man. kick out of, but how much? How much of a kick? How many kicks are you gonna take? Well, I don't know, man. He got. It kind of get like childish. I mean, but. That's what it is right now. Everything is internet shit, bro. Internet it's, beats. It's childish. It's you know? childish. It's Everything. So, so all these disses is childish too. Everybody dissing each other. But Fifty isn't making a song dissing. He should. I mean, he should not, diss Rick not. Ross. He should diss Meek Mill and P Diddy and King Combs on the same song. <laughs> he needs to make a diss song too. Fifty ain't going back in the music. <laughs> he needs to make a diss song. Like, like I said, 50 needs to just, he's just got a production studio. He got a lot of things going on. Man, come on, man. This trolling is kind of getting beneath me. Meek Mills man. jumped into it trying to defend it. I mean, Meek Mills, I mean, he's still trying to find his way. <laughs> he told you know? him he's still chasing the dream and embracing yeah, the he's a, I, Yeah, because yeah, he's still trying <laughs> to find his way. Trying to make himself relevant on something. And he's defending his own boy. Man, they had boy a lot, friend. they had it. <laughs> they said that's his boyfriend. He said, uh, "I respect you by standing by your man." <laughs> See, that's a lot of trolling. Like I don't know, it's kind of, me, it, it just getting kind of childish to me. Like I dude. mean, it's WWE, bro. Right. Everybody <laughs> go against each other. 
you know how they be talking shit before the match. <laughs> I'm gonna get you. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. And then they go to the ring and shit. You see the video game they made with uh Drake, uh J. Cole and Kendrick, the Rod they was wrestling with each other. And, I didn't see that. Oh, uh, I gotta show you that. But that was funny because it's it's that was the perfect thing to do because it's just like WWE, dog. You know what I'm saying? Like, that shit crazy. Everybody that, making a diss song. That's what hip-hop game going to. Now, like this? Yeah, that's what it is right now. Everybody dissing each other. Even Suki got a diss song towards Jay. Uh, yeah, I seen that. <laughs> I heard she that. actually spit it on it, though. She spit it on it. She destroyed JT, dog. Like, man, then Gorilla going at JT. That, yeah, Glow is for uh, JT. So everybody in the music industry is all about this beef, somebody. And this diss track. Yeah, because everybody making a diss track quick. Shaq everybody made, was <laughs> everybody was features. Now everybody making diss tracks. Shaq made one against Shannon Sharp. <laughs> yeah, he made against Shannon Sharp. I heard that too. <laughs> Come on, yo. This is getting out of here. <laughs> Not Ken, here. Kendrick yeah. and Drake done started some shit, dog. Nah. Nah, everybody like feel comfortable just to this diss is... anybody they want to. Right. R&B singers are going to start making this song. They already have Chris Brown this Cravo. I'm talking about R&B. <laughs> oh, uh, Tank so... and Tyrese. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> It's gonna be, hey. It's hey gonna but be who was Tyrese beef with? He did make a uh, diss song towards somebody. Who was he beefing with, man? I don't know. Envy. Uh, but that shit crazy, dog. Uh, game on the diss Rick Ross. What do you think about that one? What? Ah, uh, man. Game ain't getting no airplay right now. <laughs> it's just. <laughs> He's thirsty. He's thirsty. It just, he tried, a lot of this just seemed thirstful. Because he yeah. tried that shit with Eminem. <laughs> <laughs> he <laughs> might keep beef with everybody, bro. He trying to keep up with 50. Right. With all this he, can't <laughs> he can't do it. He can't do it. It don't work for him, dog. That G not was not enough. <laughs> <laughs> that was 20 that years That G not was not enough. Like, he trying to beef with everybody. Either. I don't understand it either. I do. Uh, Clout chasing. He definitely wants some clout, dog. So what makes this different from anybody else? Because his shit ain't working. Rick Ross jumped in with a right. beef. That was that was some clout shit too. <laughs> everybody, it was, dog. He ain't had nothing to do with that shit. So, so what about why everybody avoiding the fact that Future and Metro Boom Boom was the one who started the whole mix? Right. That's where it started from. It BBL wasn't BBL Drizzy. BBL oh, but, yeah. <laughs> but it started from what the uh, <laughs> I know it started before that, but they just made that BBL Drizzy song. That shit was funny. Yeah. I thought it was fake at first, but that's a real song. Yeah, yeah, with Kendrick Lamar. Yeah, yeah I see. No, yeah. it was just Metro. That's Metro Boom. Oh song. yeah, he just made, he made it just a, a a beat. Yeah. But then um, no, that was with Mustard uh, with Kendrick. Yeah, the last one with Mustard. Now, that one slapped. Now, I thought Drake would have came with a song with Kendrick Lamar came out, Not Like Us. The Bob type of this, you know, because Kendrick killed him with that. He killed him with that. He finished him with that one, dog. I thought Drake was going to do that type of song. You know what I'm saying? Like, Drake said, he said he's selling his houses and getting out of here. <laughs> getting out of here? Well, for, where are you going? He got his house shut up. Huh? He's going to France. Him and his mom. You know what I'm saying? Why? Because, man, it's too much pressure in, in the United States, man. He ain't in the United States. He in Canada. He got a house in L.A. He ain't been in that house. He ain't he been tore, He be most of shit in the United States, bro. Yeah? In Las Vegas? Don't he got a contract no, in, in Vegas? In Miami. Miami. In Miami, he do a bunch of shit. You know? But yeah, man, this shit is crazy, man. Yeah, he so, ain't going nowhere. He's staying in Canada. But we finna get to his his episode next, man. Oh yeah. <laughs> oh yeah. Alright, man. Make sure y'all stream Alpha King 3 Ride Music on all platforms, Spotify, Three. Title, YouTube. Not the B three. All the streaming sites. Wolverine, you got any shout outs? Shout out to my city. Shout out to Gun Rule City. We out of here. One love. Peace. Peace.